Hey guys, Nikki here and I have this $93 wig. Yes, $93 from AliExpress Monster Hair that I would like to share with you guys. So let's just hop straight into it. Alright guys, so let's hop straight into the wig. This is the packaging right here. You open it up and there's a wig in here and there are also wig caps in here. I love this bag because you can store your wig right back in here when you are not using it. And that's the wig cap. It comes with two pieces in there. So here's the hair color right here. You have 613 Blonde. Yes, that's 613. This is a 13 by 4 parting space there is also 180 percent density in this wig and this is 26 inches so that's what the hairline look like right there you do have two combs on the side there is a comb at the back and an adjustable strap so this is the hair color again i will pop the details across the screen in case you guys want to see it <laughs> once again 13 by 4 6 13 26 inches all right so let's just hop into what i use this is the adore rinse and honey brown i didn't really want it brown brown but y'all know this is too blonde for me so we're going to do the watercolor method and just go ahead and dye this hair or rinse it rather um, it's kind of self-explanatory, but I'm just going to talk through it so you guys can see. You put the rinse in the hair. The water is warm or hot, rather. The water is hot. And we're going to dilute it a little bit because I don't want the hair to get too brown, but I don't want it this blonde. We want it in between. And honestly, I just didn't want any colored hair right now. I didn't want a red, blue, pink, lime green. I didn't want any of that. So I went with something that's very, very safe. So after you have all of the rinse mixed in the hot water, let's just go ahead and dip the wig. Dip, baby, dip. Dip, baby, dip. And that's what you are seeing right here till you get the color desired and you just let it sit in there briefly. So you're going to rinse all of that rinse out with water and then you're going to go in with your shampoo, your conditioner or whatever you use on your wigs and go ahead and make sure that the wig is very clean and all of the extra color is out of the wig. And after you do all that, you should have this beautiful like golden blonde. It's, it's like just like the rinse set. It's like a honey brown. And that's what it looked like right there. You can never tell when it's wet like this. So what I do is sit it out because I'm in Texas and it is hot here most of the time. And this is just sitting out in my backyard to dry and it drying like 10 minutes for real. So after the hair is dry, we're just going to go ahead and get straight into the install. So I have some old braids in and I didn't want to get my hair rebraided. So that's what we're working with today. I am not going to put the wig caps on because I don't like the way they show sometime under the wig. So right here, here's the plucking process just to make sure the hairline is not boxy and to make sure that the hair is clean. Don't have to do too much dyeing um, the knots because the hair is not black. So let's hop straight into putting this on. Of course, Maya will be installing this Maya melted that will be linked below and she's just going to use this sharpie to see where the wig should be cut or where the glue should start typically where the gel should start I mean sorry where the gel should start typically but I use glue so that's what she's using right here the got to be glue and this worked just fine for me I'm allergic to latex and I just cannot have a lot of the wig glue in my head so I debated on talking through this because it's kind of like um, a visual, but I'm just going to keep talking so you guys can see what's going on here. We got so many things to talk about in this video. So let's get back into the install. She's blow drying this to make sure that it's tacky. Please make sure that this is a tacky consistency. It's not too wet um, because you don't want to put your wig down to it and it creates a lot of white residue and it just slips and slides it's just not a good thing so she's adhering the wig to my head right here and let's talk about this store a little bit we all know aliexpress got some bum wigs they have different vendors on there but we're talking about this vendor today which is moan star they sent over this wig and it is the softest wig, the easiest, the most manageable. I didn't have any shedding, any tangling, or anything with this wig. So I would highly recommend it, especially for the low, low price it is going for right now. 
So now that the hair is adhered to the head, she's just blow drying it and making sure that it's really, really in there or on there good. And just coming through it, going back through the spots to make sure that everything is good. So this is the even spray. Let's go ahead and melt the lace in. Spray this on the lace directly, the perimeter of your head. And then afterwards, you're going to blow dry this as well. The other step was for the wig. This step is for the lace. So I'm trying to show you guys different angles. So if you want to get this wig and you want to try this at home, you will can, you can just follow this step by step. So here's the edge band that's going to tie it down and make sure that it's melted on into your scalp. So right here, she's just coming through the wig. We were debating on if I was going to keep this straight or if we were going to do curls. And I said, let's just do some tight curls. So let's talk about this sale. They're having their biggest sale of the year, November 11th through the 17th. You need this wig, guys. The code MS30 will make this wig 93 bucks and if this is not your cup of tea because they have everything over there you could put that same code in on the app and it will tell you all of the other wigs that they have on sale and all of the other influencer pick wigs that they have on sale so if this is not your thing they have black wigs they have short they have bobs they have curly they have wavy they have everything over there um i was just interested in this wig because i wanted something different and that's what I did. So right here, she's cutting the lace off. She's using some really tiny scissors. And please remember that everything I talk about with this wig and this company will be linked below in the description box. You don't have to memorize anything. I will put the sale information below. I will put the discount code below. I will put all of that below the video in the description box. So this is another even melts and spray. She's going through with a little brush, making sure that it's really, really melted and that it looked like it is growing at the scalp. You're going to have to blow dry that too. Everything needs to be blow dry. We don't need anything wet still, right? So we decided on a middle part. I'm a middle part girl. I love side parts too. Tell me what's y'all favorite on me. But today we're going with a middle part. And that's what she's doing right here. Using some wax and just making me a middle part. Right here, I, as I look, I'm like, maybe I should have kept this straight. But guess what? I can always take a flat iron and go in and straighten it, right? <laughs> so, boom, the middle part is set. She's just flattening it. We need it as flat as possible over here. No helmet head, okay? She's going to go through and trim to my face. And let the curling process begin. Now with this, I typically would comb my curls out, right? To give it a fluffy, more flowy type look. But I did not this time because I feel like I like my curls to fall as the days progress. And if you comb them all out the first day, by the second day, you're having to recurl your hair again. If you leave the curls in as they are, as each day progress, it just, the, the curls naturally fall and I naturally have like this fair faucet type look and I don't have to go in and curl my hair every day. It's kind of like lazy, but hey, it works for me. So I say, yeah, comb through them, but don't comb through them too much, especially around the face and they will just naturally fall every day. That way I don't have to get up every day and curl my hair. So guys, that's the full details on this wig right here. Look how that is melted. Oh my gosh. Of course, I will make sure I leave everything below. Run on over and check out this big sale. Keep the dates in your phone so you will know. And I'll see you all in my next video.